Hello my friends and welcome back. I got a very, I don't know, embarrassing low class uh, article or the subject is low class and uh, I personally don't understand this. I try to put my put myself in you know in both both sides shoes and try to say okay what if I'm Russian what if I'm the other guys and see what is the idea here what's the point um, but I know what the point is but it's if I take the only explanation I can give it give to this incident it's just low class uh, and uh, whatever man shows who they are uh, this comes from Reuters June 5th 2022 and this is a title Closed airspace forces cancellation of Russian foreign minister's visit to Serbia. So, Russian foreign minister Sergei Lavrov's visit to Serbia has been cancelled after countries around Serbia closed their airspace to his aircraft, a senior foreign minister source told the Interfax news agency on Sunday. The, sur the source confirmed the Serbian, Serbian media report that said Bulgaria, North Macedonia, and Montenegro had closed their airspace to the plane that would have carried Moscow's top diplomat to Belgrade on, Mas on Monday. And I'm quoting, our diplomacy has yet to master teleportation, the source said. Uh, there was no immediate comment from the Russian foreign ministry. Serbia, which has close cultural ties with Russia, has faded off pressure to take sides over Russia's invasion of Ukraine and has not joined Western sanctions against Moscow. Russian President Vladimir Putin and his Serbian counterpart Alexander Vucic agreed last month that Russia would continue supplying natural gas to Serbia, while other countries have been cut off for refusing to pay for Russian gas in rubles. So there's what? Bulgaria, North Macedonia and Montenegro. If you look at I don't even know. I'm last to start with this. I spoke about this before. North Macedonia. There's no such thing as North Macedonia and South Macedonia. If you don't believe me, ask Alexander the Great, because that's where the whole thing starts. They say no, he was Greek. No, he was Macedonians. Macedonian was, was were Greek. No, but the Greeks did not consider Macedonians Greek. And Alexander the Great came from what? North Macedonia or from East Macedonia? From Pella? Or from where? Uh, West Macedonia, what? Central Macedonia? North Macedonia is a country, but South Macedonia is part of Greece. How is that possible? Anyway, so for me, that's, uh, I don't know how many are, 300 uh, humans, some uh, goats and some, uh, I don't know, uh, I don't know, olive trees. Is that, uh, I'm just kidding, obviously. And then we have the next one, Montenegro. Again, the same, Montenegro. Okay, Montenegro. How are you doing, Montenegro? Doing all right? Okay, good. And then Bulgaria. Bulgaria follows order for orders. I got that. None of these guys had independent uh, decision-making power. Be certain about that. I don't have any information. I didn't ask uh, uh, U.S. Secretary of State or the Pentagon regarding that, but I don't have to. It's obvious uh, because this country have nothing directly to do with Russia, for or against. They're not at war with them. They don't have bad relations with uh, with uh, diplomatic relations or economic relations or whatever with Russia. Now, Bulgaria, Bulgaria has because it just followed orders from Brussels and uh, said, well, OK, we're going to do something with the Russian oils and so on. OK, but I wonder why I wonder why he's not flying over. I mean, I could understand why he would not fly over Romania trying to get in Serbia to Romania, but probably Romania is too close to uh, Ukraine and too close to the Odessa area. And if you remember, there, there were some uh, vessels hit by some uh, Neptune um, rockets from that area. So I think the Americans will have uh, the coordinates right like that. So I don't think they take that chance. So uh, I don't know, maybe the Romanians are just weasels and only answer phones. Don't answer, don't answer phone, don't answer the phone, it's Lavrov, don't, don't, don't. I don't know, who the hell knows? Something like that. Well, now you tell me, okay, this is not Montenegro, North Macedonia or Bulgaria. Let's talk about the big boss. What's the purpose of this? Do you think it's just a 
you, you try physically to bar a guy to go to a country. Like the, uh, the Americans are trying to prevent Russians, Russia, to pay its creditors. Now that they don't have the money, they try to block it so they can't use their, their, their. Not there, because the, uh, uh, JP Morgan is not there. JP Morgan is just a company, independent company. But when the Secretary of State and the uh, Finance Department or whatever uh, says, you know what, you do not do that. They don't do that because they're not independent after all. You know, they have to listen to the big boss that tells you how much was the connection between uh, big business and the governments, right? The United States is not at war with Russia, just so you know. Uh, <clears throat> but imposes sanctions at will because why? Because they're the good guys and the Russians are the bad guys. You know, remember the... Uh, fight between good and evil, uh, God and Satan, that's the bang over there. So nevertheless, uh, they're just afraid. Is that, is that how you isolate Russia? Is that how you do it? Okay, if that's, it's very low. It's very low, low class, low class, trailer trash. That's what it is, low class. But nevertheless, who has eyes to see, we'll see. Who has eyes and not see then is below 86 iq i said it so and nevertheless it, that, that that that's the level that's the level i guess i guess lavrov will never be able to to speak with uh, his uh, serbian counterparts or anything like that Unbelievable. thank you very much for being with me again today stay strong stay smart look for the truth and be just